Okay, so I'm back. The one thing I've realized is I'm not quite pro yet. But going pro is not that easy. It's political, obviously. Um, even though I have my most beautiful USB webcam and my stick mic, I was horribly disappointed when editing that video uh, with the sound of this stick mic. So what I did was I went and picked up a microphone, not just any microphone, a, I think, $29 F-Deuce, F-Deuce, F-Deuce. Yep, a $29 F-Deuce. I went all out. All out on this channel. The reason, the reason I got this one was, sorry. The only reason I got this one was that um, what my kids are using in the house. <laughs> That's what we do. That's what I do here. The other thing that I did was I splurged and I walked into the house and I grabbed an actual mouse pad. This is not acceptable. That's my mouse on my um, current mouse pad out here, which is a hard mouse pad. So I grabbed this one. What do you think? Pro? I think pro. So let's replace this. I'm going to mute the mic real quick. Okay. Camera's got to be perfect. I mean, I can't have you not see me in the best light. Okay. That's a lot less clicking. So that's good. So problem solved there. At least problem averted for a little while. Okay. Let's give this F deuce a try. I mean, we'll see if it sounds any better and if I can just start using it from now on. First thing I need to do, though, is grab my keyboard here. And I'm going to, I think, I want to create a different scene. That way I can switch between the microphones and see which one sounds better. You'll be able to hear what I'm doing. Let's add another scene, scene number two. And I'm back. Nothing was on that scene. So once I switched to it, you couldn't hear or see anything. Um, one thing I can do is grab my uh, super rad USB cam and my display capture. Select them both. Copy, and I pasted it into the other scene. Um, you still can't hear me because there's not a microphone set up in there. So basically, you can just copy and paste um, sources between scenes. It's very handy. Um, if you have one scene set up already, you can copy that scene. You can use scenes and other scenes. I haven't really gotten deep into it, but uh, I think we will at some point in time. Okay, so let's add the microphone again. It's, I'm going to go quiet here for a second while I'm adding the mic. Hold on. Okay, so I bet that sounds terrible. Uh, I don't have any... Hold on. We'll do what we did before, which is come down here to F deuce. I need to turn on. Sorry, it's going to sound bad until I get noise suppression set up. Monitor and output. Okay, not too bad, but we um, we need to be able to set up all the things we set up before, you know, in the last video. So let me go ahead and do that real quick. And I'm going to slide myself over here so you know the difference. So this is scene one with the normal stick mic. And this is scene two uh, with the F deuce. All right. Uh, filters, add noise suppression. Okay, awesome. That's noise suppression. I think I wanna add the compressor. I think this was uh, four all the way up, two, and yeah, 40, maybe, I don't remember. And then I'm going to leave it like that. And remember with the output gain, 
Um, you're looking for this to be in the middle of the yellow, which it actually is already, um, and not really jumping into the red. You want to be able to hear me. One of my voice is a little more quiet. And again, this microphone is right across the uh, table here, so I think if everything was closer, it would sound better. But I'm going to leave everything as it is, and we're going to do some tests real quick between the two different scenes. I'm going to put my headphones back on, and let's give it a try. All right, this is scene one with the stick microphone. Test, test, test. And this is scene two with the Yapdus microphone. I think the second one sounds better. All right, so. I just knocked over my camera. Okay, so if I hold it here, that sounds really good. But if I switch over to the other scene, Okay. This, this sounds good too, but I think the other one sounds a little bit better. So I think I'm going to stick with it. So again, let's do the tests. All right. Hold on. God, don't have four hands. All right. This is the stick microphone. And this is the F deuce. Oh, that sounds way better. All right. So I think I'm going to stick with that. Now the question is, do I want to hold this microphone in my hand? No, I do not. Um, so let's see if I can find an optimal spot on the desk here. Uh, so I don't have to <laughs> just testing, testing. So I don't have to just sit here with this thing in my hand the whole time. Hold on. Okay. Eh. There. Now I'm sitting on the table. There is a little gain button on this microphone, which is nice. I can turn it up a little bit. Hello, hello, hello. And I can turn it down. Yep, there we go. Well, that's nice. All right. Well, I think that's about it. I got a new microphone. Camera's still the same. Uh, the more I was thinking about it, I have both uh, my iPhone and an old GoPro. So those are the only two cameras I have in the house that are other than this webcam. So I might as well give those both a try in the next video. I know I said I was going to try it in this video, but like I said, the microphone sound was atrocious. So thanks for watching. Again, if you have any comments, you can comment down below. Am I doing something wrong with the compressor, the expander, noise suppression? I'm trying my best. I'm not a pro yet but I plan to go pro and it would be awesome if you guys could help me out hit subscribe so you can get my videos in your feed that way you don't miss any and you can help me out um, but other than that see you dang it oh why do I keep knocking this thing off the table that my friends is my fumble hands uh, whatever. Still having fun. Hope you're having fun. See ya.